and being able to interact with users and understand if if it if an object comes to you and then there's been a conversation for two weeks with four other people and you forget about it, you just ask the object saying, summarize yourself. And it just summarize it and say, well, I like what Declan had to say about it. So instead of you going reading, you know, with, three weeks of history, it, it right. can interact with you in an intelligent way, or maybe you're an attorney and you get our system and you have four people working for you and uh, you want to assign things to people. So instead of sending him a message, you create this task agent and say, Declan, do X, Y, Z for this client and it it's belonging to this project, you know? So, and that object comes and tells you, and then you sit there and go, well, I need Susie's help as well. Uh, can you get Susie's help? And that object shows up in Susie's inbox. It's not that you have to send a message to Susie's inbox. So basically, this is really what changes everything. That's why in my introduction pitch, I said instead of shuffling dumb messages back and forth, you're basically exchanging intelligent objects. And these objects just know where to go because if if you tell it, uh, tell ask Declan if we need something, it's like an intelligent agent. It's not a message. It'll show up and say, hey, do we need? and it knows what to share with you. So this is really by design.